Hi, here is a slowed down version of the intro to Wagon Wheel for the New Hampshire Fiddle Ensemble and the Acoustic Roots Orchestra. So this song's in the key of A, which means there's an F sharp, a C sharp, and a G sharp. So we're gonna play an A scale so that you know what where your fingers are gonna go. So we're gonna start on the G string with an A note, okay? And we're gonna play first finger, second finger, high third finger, C sharp, open D, E, F sharp, high third finger, or a G sharp in the A. So that's one octave, but this is, notice that your fingers are apart on those two strings. This third finger's high, so we'll play that again. Three, go. And then we get to the A string. <clears throat> that's like the first scale that we learn, where we're gonna have our second and third fingers together. So it's gonna be like this, A. D. So those are the fingers we have to use for this song, okay? So it's going to start on the first finger in the D string. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to play it first so you can hear it. <clears throat> then I'm going to do it slow and then I'll play it again at the end. So here we go. One, two. I did a few <clears throat> little ornaments in there and that I'm not going to do when I teach it just to make it easier for you and I might have changed the bowing a little bit but I'm going to teach a certain bowing but fiddling with the bowing uh, <clears throat> a lot of it is uh, you know up to how you how you're feeling and you can change the bowing around but there's a few things that you want to think about you want to start with a down bow <laughs> Cause that's on a downbeat one two three and four and and then when we get to the first note of that next measure you want to be on a down bow so those are the things that we're going to try to focus on when we're bowing okay so we're going to start with the first finger on the d string and we're going to go one two on the d string e f sharp and then a b now you can look at the music but the best way to do it is to learn it by ear so that that'll help you memorize it okay so here we go again, just those four notes. One, two. A little slower. One, two. Okay, then we're gonna slur the first finger to the second finger in a little syncopation. So we did one, two, two on the A string, okay? So all together, here we go from the beginning. One, two. Okay, again, one, two. And remember, you can stop and listen and slow it down and all that. So, so now we're gonna go third finger to second finger, and then a slur again, two to one this time. So that new part is this. Three, two, two. Okay, now notice my hands are not moving around a whole lot. I'm not flying my fingers around. They're all kind of staying right like that, okay? So here we go from the beginning. One, two. Okay. Okay, one more time. One, two. Okay, then we're gonna do another slur on two to one. Okay, so two, one, and then zeros on and up. And then we're gonna go to the D string and play E to F sharp with the slur, or one to two. Okay, so we got we have this now. One, two, three. 
One, two, three. Okay, so all together from the beginning. <clears throat> One, two. We're gonna go up the scale and we're gonna have to use that high third finger. So it's gonna slur one to two on the D string, high three on the up bow, hit that again, A, A. So here it is again, one, two, three. So we're coming in what's called an offbeat, right? One, two, three. Okay, so all together from the very beginning, really slow, okay? Here we go. One, two. your first line now if you listen to go listen to catch a c chord play it was the old crow medicine show like i said so he'll he'll be going so there's a little like a roll in there so um so if you want to go back and listen to that and put some of those in once you get it comfortable that's good all right one more time on that and then we'll keep going okay <clears throat> ready here we go one two Now we're on an up bow. We're going to go on the A string. One, two, three. Okay, up bow. Ready? One, two, three. Okay, so now we're on this part. This whole, just a whole bunch of eighth notes now. No more syncopation. It's going to go E, C sharp, E, F sharp. So E on the open E. A, two, E, one. So three. Four. Okay, and then the next group of four goes E, A2, one, open A. So here is that group of four, three, one, two. Okay, so let's put those two groups of four together. So we have one, two, three, four. And again, if you need to stop the video and go back and listen or put it on slow, <clears throat> you can do that. Okay, so with the pickups now, one, so I'm going to play that with the pickups, okay? One, two, and three. So keep going with groups of four. We just have one, zero, one, zero on the A string. B, A, B, A. Then we're going to go E, A, D, A, or E. So those two groups of four are this. Got a little string change there, okay? So again, ready, go. Okay? And then the next group of four is two, three, two, one. C sharp, D, C sharp, B. Here we go again. Three, four. And then you're going to go down the scale from the A, which means you got to use that high third finger. Open A. Again. Okay, those two groups of four. Three, four. Okay. And then you're going to use your second finger on the D to open A, to back to second finger. One, two, zero, two, one. Here we go. F sharp, A, F sharp, E. And then down the scale from the D note with the high third finger. You might have to get your elbow in there to get that C sharp because if, you, if your arm is back, you won't be able to, you won't be able to get that string, so. Okay, so 
I'm gonna put all of these groups of four together, okay, with the pickups, okay? So, ready? One and two and three. that one more time a little slower okay one and two and three Good. Now the last line has some syncopation again, which means there's some notes that are on the off beats. And so you're going to go two, three, three. And that's the high three on the G string. And the feel is. And notice I slurred the first two notes on a down bow. Okay, then we're going to go back to open D, back to three. Here we go again. So I'm going to play all that. Three, four. Okay, and then I'm going to go three, two, two, three, two on the G string. Ready, go. Okay, and then two, one, one, three, two, still on the G string, so you got to keep your elbow around. Three, go. B, A, B A, A, C sharp, B. And then you end with a B, A, A slur again. So notice all those little sections had a slur at the beginning. So here's the last line that I just gave you with all that syncopation. So three, four. Okay, just a couple things before I play the whole thing again. Is you want to try to keep your fingers down as much as possible, like that little part in the middle. See how my fingers are staying down? Which means you have to keep your fingers around. Okay, so, okay, from the beginning, nice and slow, and uh, this will give you something to practice with, and then uh, then we'll talk about how to make it sound a little bit more fiddly, okay? When we get together, okay? Here we go. One, two. You can use your fourth finger too there. Not too hard really, You're just putting your fourth finger right next to your third, so. Okay, so there's wagon wheels, something to practice with and use to learn by ear. Have fun!